Hey everyone, um, I just want to start off this video by saying that I hope everyone is doing well and staying safe and I know that quarantine has been pretty rough but I hope all of you are finding ways to occupy yourself. Um, thank you for joining this morning's journey to the Empty Tomb Online Worship Devotional. We would like to invite you to join us this Sunday for our Easter service as we won't be worshiping from an empty room but celebrating an empty tomb. Um, I'm going to be reading Mark 14, 53 through 65, and you can follow along with me if you have your Bible with you, or you can just listen, and then I'm going to sing, um, Lead Me to the Cross. And so this passage is taking place after Jesus was arrested from the garden, and um, he's being tried. And so it says, they took Jesus to the high priest, and all the chief priests, the elders, and the teachers of the law came together. Peter followed him at a distance, right into the courtyard of the high priest. There he sat with the guards and warmed himself at the fire. The chief priests and the whole Sanhedrin were looking for evidence against Jesus so that they could put him to death, but they did not find any. Many testified falsely against him, but their statements did not agree. Then some stood up and gave this false testimony against him. We heard him say, I will destroy this temple made with human hands, and in three days we'll build another not made with hands. Yet even then their testimony did not agree. Then the high priest stood up before them and asked Jesus, Are you not going to answer? What is the testimony that these men are bringing against you? But Jesus remained silent and gave no answer. Again the high priest asked him, Are you the Messiah, the Son of the Blessed One? I am, said Jesus, and you will see the Son of Man sitting at the right hand of the Mighty One and coming on the clouds of heaven. The high priest tore his clothes. Why do we need any more witnesses, he asked. You have heard the blasphemy, what do you think? They all condemned him as worthy of death. Then some began to spit at him, they blindfolded him, struck him with their fists and said, prophecy, and the guards took him and beat him. So um, what I take away from this passage is that Pretty much the trial was rigged. Like they had already pretty much decided that Jesus was gonna die and that they were gonna find a way to find him guilty. And they were doing false testimonies, but they weren't lining up so they couldn't accuse him for that. And then they finally got him because then if you said that you were the son of God, then that was blasphemy. And so they decided that um, that was enough and that he was gonna be crucified. And um, I just think this passage is kind of just the beginning of all that happens um, leading up to the cross and what Jesus has to go through. And at the end of this, they're spitting on him and beating him and hitting the, him with their fists. And I think that that's kind of what Easter is about, is us remembering what Jesus did for us and why it's important. And the song I'm going to sing says... Savior, I come, quiet my soul, remember. Redemption's hill where your blood was spilled for my ransom. So it's saying, like, here I am, I'm quieting my soul, I'm going to remember what you did for me. Why you spilled your blood for me. Um, and I think that that's one of the reasons that Easter is so important is because we're remembering what Jesus did for us. And I think sometimes we can become numb to that and... We just hear, oh, Jesus died for my sins, Jesus died for my sins, over and over again, and we don't really think about it, and we don't appreciate it as much as we should. And I just think that it really shows what kind of God we have, um, that he would die for us, and that he would come down and be a perfect man and go through all of that for us. So um, just think about that as I sing this song. And uh, feel free to sing along with me if you're in your house, in your living room, in your car, it doesn't matter. Um, or you can just think about the words of this song and what I just talked about. Savior, I come. Quiet my soul. Remember, read 
Redemption's Hill, where your blood was spilled for my ransom, and everything I once held dear, I count it all as lost. Lead me to the cross where your love poured out. Bring me to my knees, Lord, I lay me down. Rid me of myself, I belong to you. Oh, lead me. Lead me to the cross. As I tempted and tried Human The word became flesh For my sin and death Now you're risen And everything I once held dear I count it all as lost Lead me to the cross Where your love poured out Bring me to my knees Lord, I lay me down Rid me of myself I belong to you Oh, lead me Lead me to the cross To your heart To your heart Lead me to your heart Lord, I lay me down Rid me of myself I belong to you Oh, lead me Lead me